and that structure was really resonating. We go to the World Cup, we're all into sport. That was cool to have. And it's awesome to have some of these events spread throughout the gap year. That's a really important thing as well. Playing back into that macro structure idea. A gap year is going to be a lot better. I found it to be a lot better when I knew there were things coming in the future. Again, if you just plonk yourself in a country and go, okay, go. Three to six months, I'm just here. It's like, that's probably too much flexibility and spontaneity at least for me to enjoy. I find that everyone says there needs to be some structure. Everyone's threshold though is different and I appreciate that. Personally, I liked having quite a bit of structure around those core events, but we had tons of flexibility within it. We're going to Peru for three months. We can travel on weekends, we can take weeks off. We ended up going to the Amazon for two weeks as part of that kind of volunteering and we did some work in the jungle, literally in the Amazon, in the Peruvian side. Did that for two weeks. We did other trips. We went to Bolivia. We went to other parts of Peru. We did really fun things. You know, we went to these sand dunes and went on this kind of tour bus around with other people who were a similar age. And we were just having the time of our lives.